Welcome to the Django series. In this video, I will talk about two more important files under the project folder that is url.py and manage.py in the Django project. So these two files are also very important. So first I'll explore url.py. So url.py file is by default create when we create a project. It is a predefined path for admin app. So if I open that file, you can check that URL pattern consists of path admin admin site.url. So this admin URL is already be inbuilt in the URL.py. As soon as we add the small small app in the project, for that we can set a different URL. That we'll see in the further discussion how we can set the URL for the each and every application. Whenever I write a specific function in the project, that function will be called through this URL. So we need to add that function in this url.py the next important file is manage.py as we are discussing in the second video that this is a command line utility to run the django server so whenever you create a project by default this file is get created now we will need to run the project so whenever you want to run the project you need to go to that particular project so i need to write the command cd and prg2 so i just check whether i am inside the project or not under that project folder you can find manage.py file whenever you want to execute the project we need to check that file should be in the project folder so you need to type a command after that python manage.py and run server so that your project will execute and it will gives you one url and it will give you one url just control click on the url you can find the project is running so this is very basic so this is the very initial command to execute a project you can find django has been installed successfully and project has been run without any kind of error in the project so hope you understand how to run a project i'll again explain that what type of command you need to write on the terminal so whenever you run the project you need to check whether that manage.py is in the same folder or not then type a command python manage.py run server you can note down this command every time when you run the project you require this command so once i run the command you will get one url just click on that url you can find your project is successfully executed without any error so hope you understand how we are going to run the project so this this is all about url.py and manage.py in the next video, we'll see how to create a small app in the project and then write the business logic for that. Thanks for watching this video.